Hey, 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 it's the Pacific Northwest Ski Care Echo Zero. In my previous haul video, I said that I would um, be showing off my still book collection. I have probably about 20, 20 plus, with two of them being actually video games. But I thought I'd break it into uh, pairs of two. Um, horror and non-horror. And um, I'm going to start with the horror. I don't know when I'll film the non-horror. But let's start with the horror. Oh, I got them right here. And one of them will be a video game. It's got a bit of a story behind why I have it as a still book. Of my collection, this one has my favorite design for the cover. For the casing. I really love this. Um, this is uh, the original My Bloody Valentine. It has the uh, theatrical cut and the uncut version of it. And I really love that. Let's get this like this. I think that's uh, I think it's pretty cool. I love that. Inside it says, "From the heart comes a warning filled with bloody good cheer. Remember what happened as the fourteenth draws near." Just a little bit over here. I love that cover. Um, this is the first horror movie I credit has ever seen. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I don't think there's really anything on the inside. Yeah, some of these have stuff on the inside, some don't. So, it's pretty cool to have. This is one of the newer ones I got here recently. Found this at Best Buy. On the Screen Factory. The Fog. Again, it's got a pretty cool cover. Just not as cool as... Um, I think none of these are as cool as the one for um, My Bloody Valentine. Uh, this is an awesome must-see movie in my opinion. So glad it's in my collection. Double glad that it is still book. Crane du Busson. And we take the disc out here because it does have something kind of cool on the inside. I think that's pretty awesome. Uh, this one I can't show the back of because I'm sure some people might, you know, get upset. But Toby Hooper's Life Force. It's a pretty cool cover. Um, pretty pretty cool image. Uh, you know, the woman in the. Probably the space vampire sucking out some guy's energy. Inside, she destroyed worlds. <laughs> this is actually one of the two newest ones, because there's two new ones, uh, one horror and one non-horror. The Evil Dead. Now, if I can find this again. Exactly the same. Just well, the color's different. It's both of them Anchor Bay. Both are disc number BD two one four six six one. Only difference is is well, this is just a standard one. This will probably be going into the bin. I should actually put it to the side because that's going to go into the bin. Now that I have this and uh, there's the back. I don't think there's really anything on the yeah, nothing really on the inside, but yeah. That's pretty cool. I have got in the uh eight uh the um Blu-ray that comes with the eight movies from this series, from the Friday the thirteenth series. And then shortly thereafter I found a still book um for the first one. I guess there are some other still books. I've been looking for them. I have a little trouble finding the ones that are available. And when I do, I've found a couple aren't available anymore. Or got to wait for them to get more. But there we go. Kill her, mommy. Kill her. The inside is a 
If I can get a good price for the other ones, I'd love to pick the, all of these up like this. Now, these last four. I have all five of the Underworld movies. But there is an issue. Only four of them I've been able to find as still books. I have not been able to find this as a still book. And if I do, that's a big catch. They all come with covers that, you know, have similar art style. So here you go. Let's put it here. Got the first one. Which, the back is just a... This back is just a close-up. That's what they do in all of them. Of right here. They even recycled. I saw this image of her. They recycled that image. Over here. Uh, evolution. Again, close up a part of the artwork. Rise of the Lycans. This is like the prequel to the series. Again, I swear they just uh, recycled that image and just uh, from the first one, just changed some stuff about it. Maybe I'm wrong. And the Awakening. And if I ever find this as a still book, its style has to match those other ones. It has to be a good price, and it has to match them as other ones. So even if it's on a good price, if it doesn't match that art style, I'm not going to get it. So hopefully they made one. But there's a bonus one for the horror ones. I am a big, I became a big fan of the game Back for Blood. And I have it for PS4 and for Xbox One. Uh, and uh, they took at, at Best Buy selling $10 still books for games. You basically spent whatever it is you spend on the game. And for another $10 you can get a still book. Such a fan of this game. At one point, I picked it up. I only picked up one of these because, yeah, I don't need two of these. One for Xbox and one for PlayStation. This one holds the uh, the Xbox, and there is an image in here. Let me take this stuff out of one of the ridden. Forget what type that is. And this is one of two still books I have for gaming. The other one is non-horror. Now, a few horrors I am eyeing that I would like to get on as a still book. And again, there might be a few non. But I'm going to be taking it more serious. Anyways, I will be eventually at some point making one for my non-horror, but I really at this time don't feel like doing it. Anyways, watch. Uh, thanks for joining me. And uh, if you have any still books, I would like to hear what you have. It would be kind of cool, you know, to see what you guys have. Anyways... Thanks for joining me and watch PS. Hey, 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 it's the Pacific Northwest Geek. Or your girl a month, grab that fireball, let's get crunk. Come on, hop in, let's ride over to the Echo side. This is the sound that's okay, go catch you on the flip side. I'm like a zero, and I will see you on the flip side.